Today we're going to review part number K1HR35S. This is the Kodiak disc brake assembly. It has the 10 inch hub and rotor with the 5 on 4.5 inch bolt pattern, stainless steel finish, and has a 3,500 pound weight capacity. Now, this brake assembly will make it easy to upgrade from drum to disc brakes, gives you better performance, and it'll also give you more consistent stopping even at highway speeds and a dramatically shorter stopping distance. Now the maintenance costs for the disc brakes are lower than for drum brakes because you have fewer moving parts to maintain, repair, or replace. Now this does use the industry standard bearings, seals, and races which are all included. On the rotor itself you can see it has the uh, vented design to it which will effectively dissipate the heat and that will prevent any heat related damage to the rotor itself. Now if you notice the hub itself is a galvanized finish, the rotor is stainless steel. So basically you would just slide this right over, just like that, to give you all one piece when you install it. Now the hub will have the bearing races already pre-installed, the inner races pre-installed and the outer races all pre-installed. Now the stainless steel and the galvanized construction is very durable and rust proof. It's ideal for extended marine use. They both have a 1,000 hour salt spray rating on them. Now the caliper itself is a stainless steel caliper which is self-adjusting. Gives you nice smooth equal braking. The stainless steel construction is not flex like aluminum. And it has a low drag design. If I pop out the brake pad you can see the stainless steel piston in there. It's a low drag design which means it will retract the piston further back in there keeps the brakes off the rotor so it gives you a cooler running brake. The stainless steel piston is also two and a quarter inches in diameter which is about 30 percent larger than some of the other brands and since it's larger it'll give you more braking torque than the competition. And then the brake pads you can see they use a high performance ceramic brake pad in the caliper. The mounting bracket it is stainless steel also provides strength and durability you can see the way it's constructed. It has the nice side support design. This will ensure that the load is placed on the whole bracket, not just on the bolts. At the very top where the caliper guide bolts go, it has some extra embossing. Gives you the additional thread contact for those caliper guide bolts, which will ensure a tight, secure mount for the caliper. And if you'll notice, this has goes on to a four-bolt brake mounting flange configuration. So it, you need to have an axle that would have a four bolt brake flange on it. If you don't, we do sell a four bolt brake flange, a weld on flange. Uh, so we do sell separately on our website. Now this kit includes everything shown here. It includes the stainless steel rotor with the galvanized hub assembly, the stainless steel caliper, the two stainless steel caliper mounting bolts, the one stainless steel caliper mounting bracket with the four bolts and nuts all included, the inner and outer bearings and the grease seal and the grease cap and five half inch wheel lug nuts. Now one note I do want to mention is that when you do use or you, when you change over to disc brakes it does require a higher line pressure of about 1500 psi compared to the standard drum brakes of about a thousand. So what you do want to make sure is that the brake actuator on your trailer will have at least a minimum of a 1500 psi rating few specs on this again, the axle it goes on is a 3,500 pound axle with a number 84 spindle. It uses a wheel size of 14 inches and larger. The bolt pattern would be a 5 on 4 and a half inch bolt pattern. And again the wheel stud diameter is the half inch, uses the half inch included lug nuts. The rotor diameter is 10 inches. And again it dismounts to a 4 bolt brake flange configuration. But that should do it for the review on part number K1HR35S, the Kodiak disc brake assembly with the 10-inch hub and rotor with the 5 on 4.5-inch bolt pattern.